this is resistor connections. There are two common methods of connecting resistors. These connections are series and parallel. In series connections, two or more resistors are tied together like a chain. The individual resistances are added up for the total resistance. In parallel connections, two or more resistors are connected across the same connection. In this method of connection, the individual resistances are not added. For series connection, the formula is RT is equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3 Example R1 equals 5 ohms R2 equals 3 ohms R3 equals 8 ohms Using the formula in series, because the connection is connected in series, RT is equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3. Substitute R1, that is 5 plus R2 is 3 plus R3 is 8. Get this arm. 5 plus 3 plus 8. 5 plus 3, that is 8. Plus 8, that is 16. 16 ohms. Therefore, if three resistors connected in series to which R1 is equal to 5, R2 is equal to 3, then R3 is equal to 8, the answer is 16 ohms. Another connection is parallel. Simplifying solutions for determining the total resistance of parallel resistors we can adapt the following methods the two or more resistors with the same values connected in parallel simply divide the value of one resistor by the number of resistors example is This is R1 and this is R2. R1 is equal to 20 then R2 is equal to 20 ohms. Using the formula, because this is only a combination of two resistors having equal values. So the formula is RT or total resistance that is equal to the value of the resistor which is 20 then divide 2 because they have an equal value 20 divide 2 that is 10 10 ohms 
therefore two resistors connected in parallel having two equal value which is 20 ohms the total resistance is 10 ohms another example This is R1, R2, R3, and R4. R1 is equal to 20 ohms. R2 is equal to 20 ohms. R3 is 20 ohms. R4 again is 20 ohms. Using the formula, RT is equal to 20 over 4. 20 is the value of resistors. R1, R2, R3, and R4 to which we have the same value then 4 is the number of resistors 20 divided by 4 that is equal to 5 ohms that is the total resistance of 4 resistors connected in parallel having the value of 20 ohms Another method is if there are two resistors of unequal values connected in parallel, the total resistance is smaller than the lowest value of an individual resistor in the circuit. The formula is RT is equal to multiply the two values over added the two values. We have an example. Two resistors connected in parallel to which R1 is equal to 10 ohms, then R2 is equal to 20 ohms this is your R1 in R2 so in this case two resistors connected in parallel but they have an equal value R1 is 10 ohms R2 this is R2 R2 is 20 ohms the formula is RT is equal to R1 times R2 over R1 plus R2. Substitute R1 times R2 that is equal equal to 10 times 20 over 10 plus 20 equals 10 times 20 that is 200 over 10 plus 20 that is equal to 30 200 divided 30 that is equal to 6.66 ohms therefore the total resistance of R1 and R2 to which R1 is equal to 10 ohms 
in R2 is equal to 20 ohms the total resistance is 6.66 ohms another example we have 3 resistors connected in parallel having an equal value this is your R1 and this is R2 then R3 R1 R1 is equal to 10 ohms R2 is equal to 5 ohms then R3 is equal to 2 ohms in this case we'll use the reciprocal method using this formula we have RT RT is total resistance is equal to 1 over 1 over R1 plus 1 over R2 plus 1 over R3 equals 1 over 1 over R1 substitute 1 over R1 that is 1 over 10 plus 1 over uh, substitute R2 that is 5 plus 1 over R3 substitute R3 that is equal to 2 equals 1 over 1 over 10 that is 0.1 1 over 5 that is equal to 0.2 in plus 1 over 2 that is 0.5 equals 1 over get the sum of point 0.1 plus point 0.2 plus point 0.5 that is equal to point 0.8 equals 1 divided point 0.8 that is equal to 1.25 ohms using the reciprocal method 3 resistors connected in parallel to which R1 is equal to 10 ohms, R2 is equal to 5 ohms, R3 is equal to 2 ohms, the total resistance is 1.25 ohms. That is the total resistance for the 3 resistors connected in parallel.